Okay, okay. That was a uh, that was a brief intermission. That was a brief intermission. You guys, you guys know what I like to do. I usually like to. Uh... take songs and uh I, I got a whole bunch of my other songs but i like to remix songs but let's get back to the practice at hand we're starting on arpeggios to arpeggiate means to take a simple chord a chord is three notes and this is what it means to arpeggiate break it up so again we're in the key of f or the scale of f we haven't gotten to that part yet i'm getting past the stuff i don't like to do uh, or you know what yeah, let's backtrack that. Let's work on, okay, so what is the key of F? Key of F is F, G, A, D, C, D, E. And the next octave, of course, is F. But um, it's actually F all the way to E with one accidental, one incidental, which is called the B flat. So if we're practicing that, usually we, we did the five finger, we did the taps, uh, which kind of went... Hands loose. I call it getting the hands wet. You know, going up the five finger pattern. All this boring stuff is the most important stuff that you need to know. So um, I know I said we we're going to start off on arpeggios. Should I go that way? Yeah, let's 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 hold back on that. If I got the last number of minutes, we'll uh we'll work on that. But let's work on the scale of F major. I have to point out major because the scales change from major, minor, diminished, etc., etc. So if we're looking in the the key of F, make sure you guys can see my hand. So. That's how it should that's how it should sound that's how it should be fingering position is very important with the F starting on I'm sorry the thumb starting on the F index finger G middle finger a ring finger B flat C but if we're going up the scale thumb on the F, G, A, B flat, thumb again on the C. Your ring finger lands on that F. That was your right hand. Left hand is going to be similar with your pinky finger starting on the key of F. And your thumb landing on F. So, keep uh, see, see how that's done. F, pinky finger, ring finger, G, middle finger, A, index finger on B flat. Your thumb is on, gonna land on C. Ring finger D, index finger E, F. Um, 
even tone between both. So let's do both hands. Why is it wrong? Why was that wrong? Because I'm starting pinky here. This is why fingers is very important. So, so watch this. Let me fix. Let me correct that. So do it again. Oh, hold on. No, no. Recap that. So F. Got that there. Okay, now we can roll on to the arpeggios. And we're going to arpeggiate. Remember, um, well, hold on, hold on. Blah, blah, blah. Rewind that, rewind that. Not arpeggios, those are fun. We did the um, we did the inversions. We did the inversions. Now what we want to do, in my opinion, is we want to do block chords. <laughs> Good old block chords. And the way we're gonna do block chords is we're gonna go through each one of the F major, F major minor. Seven F diminished, and we're gonna go through the F augmented seven. Yes, yes, and remember, I'm taking this from the stuff I don't like to do, all the way down to the all the way down to the fun stuff. Get the, I mean, get good at the hard stuff. So, um, so if we're doing block chords, so we're gonna start off with the key of F major seven. Again, that is F. You got the fifth landing on the, I'm sorry, the F, the third landing on the A, the fifth landing on the C, and the seventh landing on the E. So um, we're going to start off, this is how you do block chords. Get your posture ready. That last note is an F. I really need to get better stuff here. Anybody got a suggestion, please let me know. <laughs> so here we go. Remember, just up the board. Yes, my hands up. 
we go. So again, you guys didn't see my hands. Now you get to see my hands. F major seven. F. Now we're going to go to the F major minor seven, which is going to remember we're just going to move it, move your third up to A flat. Yes. Keep going. Remember, this is block chords. Sorry. Now, notice I took my finger, I took my foot off the sustain pedal because it helps your fingers build strength and dexterity. Something sounds wrong right there. You hear that? You hear how your ear caught it? Your ears will your ears will be picking out stuff. There you go. Go back up. F major minor seventh chord. Next we're gonna move on to the F minor seven. F again. F major, uh, F minor seven is the key of F, A flat, C, and E flat. Those are your axis dentals, as I like to call them. As they call them, as they are properly called in the UK. So remember, this is the F minor seven. diminished seven. Now your F diminished, just like that. F A flat, remember we're going to take the C and the E flat and we're going to bring it down basically one half step. So you're going to be, so remember, F and A flat stay the same. F and A flat stay the same. You guys have to see the fingers. What we're going to do is we're going to bring that down. Hear how the difference? You know. Anyway, I did something with uh, just the two of us. Should I do it now? Should I do it now? Uh, <laughs> uh, distraction time. Just the two of us was in the key of A flat though. <laughs> and we'll get to how that connects later. But I had an ending kind of like a, a let me see. minute marker hold on let me move this up it's 14 yeah we're at the 15 minute marker uh um we'll do the f diminished with the next video so we, remember this one we did the what we did the we did the arpeggiation in the f major seven we even did the f major minor seven 